best way I have done it before that worked was get yourself one of those coolers, like a foam cooler. You can get it at any gas station and you can cut a hole out, put a light bulb in there, or you can cut it out and have a grate over of a light bulb on the top to keep it at 99.5 degrees Fahrenheit and a spray bottle to keep a humidity of 50 to 60%. And you will need to hand turn three to four times a day, and you should be able to have some success. It does need consistency. It's not a done-for-you setup. You're going to have to keep an eye and monitor the temperatures and have at least two thermometers in your incubator and a hygrometer to measure the humidity. Humidity is as important as the temperature because if it is too dry in there, you're going to get some chicks that hatch and get stuck to the egg, or if it's too wet in there, they're going to drown in the egg. But this by far seems to be one of the successful, easy, cost-effective ways to make a homemade incubator.